especially the last couple hundred years when we really started to process and, and learn how to uh, manipulate grains and sugars and high-carbohydrate foods. Anyway, that's for another day. We'll continue talking about connective tissue tomorrow. Time to hit our phones, 855-660-4261. Dave in Michigan, welcome to the Bright Side. What's up, buddy? Hi, Ben. Oh, You're not Dave? Dave? Is, that, is that your middle name or something? Right. I'm sorry. Um, well, actually, it's a friend of mine um, has an issue, and uh, this is Dave's wife, Pam. Thank you so much for taking my call, and sure. you have helped my family so much. I am Thank so, you. so grateful to you. Um, I appreciate that. The information, though, not me. It's the information. It I don't is. Take credit you for are it. better than any schooling that I've ever heard. Oh, thank you. I appreciate that. You what's, are awesome. Okay, what's my going friend on? is. Well, no, um, you can tell me how awesome I am for a little bit, and then we'll go to. No, I'm okay, just. Okay, you but, are. You have no. my third stage kidney disease. I have autoimmune system problem that's been going on, and you taught me about the bone soup and everything. And oh, good. Yes, that's, uh, that's I have awesome. Learned so much. So, and, so uh, what's going on? What's going on today? How can we help? Okay, she's 37. She has IgA nephrology, minimal nephropathy. Disease. Yes. And, kidney uh, disease. Yes. Okay. You want some help with that? Please. They went okay. on uh, chemo. That's and, uh, silly. Silly. IgA is a is the shortened term for immune globulin A. Immune globulins are also known as antibodies. Antibodies. I love that term. Antibodies. They fight bodies. Except they don't fight your body. They, well, they, at times they do, but they're supposed to fight the enemy. IgA, there's five different uh, antibodies. There's IgA, IgD, uh, uh, IgM. Uh, there's various, various ones. Ig, I forgot the, the different letters here. But in any case, there's, there's five different antibodies. Uh, the most important one is uh, IgA. Uh, the other ones, uh, are, there are other ones that are all important, really. But the most important ones are, are IgA, IgD, E. Uh, uh, G and M are different antibodies that are found in different parts of the body. But the reason I say IgA is so important and probably the most important is because that's the one that's found in the gut, it's found in the lungs, it's found in your tears, it's found in breast milk, it's, uh, it's found in the urinary tract. Uh, IgA is, the, is the, our main defense antibody for food. So if you have IgA nephropathy, by definition, you have a food problem, period, end of story. IgA is an immune is an antibody that will combine. It will stick to, to uh, problem foods or problem food substances, and then that that combination of IgA and the food substance will circulate through the blood and hopefully get excreted. However, over time it starts to pile up because it's, it, it gets overloaded. And then when it piles up, it starts to clog up the blood. The kidneys are your blood purifying system, and they're unbelievably ti- uh, made up of unbelievably tiny circulatory vessels. And over time, as these IgA food complexes build up in the blood, they can start to clog up the kidneys. That's what IgA nephropathy is, period. You don't need chemotherapy, people. I will guarantee you with 100% surety, Dave Pam, Dave slash Pam, if you, uh, your friend goes on a three-day fast, they will immediately notice an improvement in their IgA nephropathy. Now, you may have a hard time getting them to do a three-day fast, but just theoretically, if they did, immediate improvement. Immediamente, no doctor required, no drugs required, and certainly no toxic poisons like chemotherapy required. More, more fundamentally, for the long term, your friend has to focus on digestive health and wellness. I know you guys are probably saying, not more digestive health and wellness, not more digestive strategies. I can't help it. This is the core of disease. IgA nephropathy screams digestive problems. Do you know this person well, Pam? Did you say your name was Pam? I just met her, and um, I told her that my kidney disease was cured by you. And, not me. Uh, not well, me. The information. Advice. I'm not John of God. I'm just a right. pharmacist. And um, so I invited her over, and I gave her uh, Dead Doctors Don't Lie tape and showed her, you know, what we take, and, um, and I told her I'd call you. Okay, well, food number one, focus on food intolerances. She's got to have long-standing digestive problems. Correct those immediately. That means probiotics. Get on the bioluminightly essence. That means liquid nutrients because she's probably malnourished from her long-term digestive issues. The BTT is extremely helpful in this regard. Anything she could use, anything she could do to help open up the blood and move the blood along is going to help. Getting on a rebounder will help. A magnesium, 3,000, 2, 2 to 3,000 milligrams a day. Magnesium glycinate. The Healthy Start Pack is just a must 
for everybody. Essential fatty acids are very important. Digestive enzymes after all meals and digestive enzymes on an empty stomach. Uh, digestive enzymes have a nice blood thinning effect. That's how you want to look at moving the circulatory system around and correcting digestive problems. That's how you deal with kidney issues, especially IgA issues, immune globulin issues. She's got an immune problem. She's got a circulatory problem. Focus on the digestive system. And one more thing, and then focus on moving the blood around. Even something like oxygenation can be very, very important. Practice deep breathing techniques. I'm sorry. Go ahead, ma'am. Well, um, the digestive enzymes before or after? I suggest. Doesn't really matter. It does as long as they're in there when you got the food. You know, if you take them at the beginning of your meal, at the end, it's not too much of a difference. But if you take them on an empty stomach, they can have even more blood thinning effects. If you take them with your food, they'll have digestive system effects, and that's good. They'll help you process food, and sometimes just enzymes will help you eliminate food intolerances. So, uh, and use apple cider vinegar, by the way, with your enzymes. But on an empty stomach, they can have blood thinning effects. They can help break up clogs in the blood and in the lymph. Okay, right. I got that. Um, and the, I, you talked to Dave uh, a couple weeks ago, and he was suggesting um, the biooalternative.net for the uh, colostrum. Okay. Yeah, um, you had wanted to know about that, and I was supposed to send you an email. I shot it out today. Sorry it took so long. No problem. I'll check my email as soon as I get off, get off the air. All right. Thank you so much. You are so great. <laughs> God bless you. Thank you. I appreciate it. I appreciate that. Thank you so much. Have a beautiful day. God bless. All right. Uh, moving on. Got. Uh, let's see if we can take a call here before we get to our break here. Lori in California, welcome to the Bright Side. What's up? Hi. Hi. I'm um, sorry. I, I didn't hear my name. Uh, Pharmacist Ben, my name's Lori, and Hi, Lori. I have a very similar question to that prior call. I have okay. glomerulonephritis, and I'm probably killing the verbiage. <laughs> That's but, a tongue twister. Um, I take... The Cinepro, okay. 20 milligrams uh, Not, once a day, and I'm wondering if I could drop that and what you drop. I, I, hang tight. We'll, we'll t I'll talk to you about Lysinopril and glomerular nephritis when we come back from our break. Hang tight, Lord. All right, I'm Pharmacist Ben. You're listening to The Bright Side. We'll be back after this. I'm Dr. Joel Wallach, the Dead Doctors Don't Lie Guy. There's no reason why you shouldn't live to be at least 100 and have a great time getting there. And I'm going to give you a free copy of my lecture that tells you exactly how to do it. In fact, after you've lived a long and healthy life, there should be only two documents in your medical chart, a birth certificate and a death certificate. I'm Dr. Wallach with a warning. If you have a four-inch medical chart, if you take prescription drugs for high cholesterol, high blood pressure, arthritis, joint pains, and other health issues, the medical profession is failing you. They're using you for an ATM machine. My free lecture is going to reveal what pharmaceutical companies don't want you to know. There's been groundbreaking research and discovery on how to effectively treat or eliminate over 900 different diseases naturally. And it's all in my free lecture called Deadly Recipe. So call toll-free 1-855-79-YOUNG. Again, that's toll-free 1-855-79-YOUNG. 1-855-79-YOUNG. So we decided to upgrade the look of our home. You know, improve the curb appeal. We decided to add the look of stone to the exterior. We really like the stacked stone look. Yeah, but when I checked into the price, it was ridiculous. No way could we afford it. Then a friend told me about Genstone. G-E-N-S-T-O-N-E. -E. Genstone comes in lightweight panels made of polyurethane. They've actually engineered the hassle out of installation. No mortar, no mesh. It was easy. Even I could do it. We just screwed the panels to the wall and it looks like stone. Stone. I mean, it really looks like stone. Yeah, from the box to the wall in minutes. We love the look of our home now. And Genstone is durable, comes with a 25-year warranty, and offers additional R-value for insulation. If you want the look of stone at a price you can afford, call Genstone. At 855-955-STONE. Trust me, you'll save money. And you'll love the look. 855-955-STONE. That's 855-955-7866. If you owe the IRS back taxes, listen carefully. Sweeping changes to IRS policies will help more people than ever eliminate their tax debts once and for all. And now, I can help you reduce or eliminate your tax debts and end your tax nightmare. Hi, I'm Dan Pilla. I've helped thousands of people reduce and eliminate tax debts they couldn't pay. And after more than 30 years of experience dealing with the IRS, I can tell you there's no such thing as a hopeless tax case. And with the IRS's new policies, it's easier than ever to put your tax debt behind you once and for all. Call now at 800-346-6829 to learn how I can help you. 
You know your IRS debt will not go away by itself, but you don't have to live in fear anymore. Call 800-346-6829. Learn how I can help you eliminate wage and bank levies, release tax liens, and negotiate a settlement with the IRS that will put your tax nightmare behind you forever. Call 800-34-NO-TAX or go to TaxHelpOnline.com. That's TaxHelpOnline.com. For over five years, you've been hearing about the Berkey guy, so you may know a few things about him. For example, you are well aware of the superior quality and effectiveness of Berkey water filters and accessories. But did you know the Berkeys have had independent lab tests done to prove just how effective they are? It's true, and he can email you the test results. Just visit GoBerkey.com. You may also know that the Berkey guy has helped tens of thousands of people get better prepared. Now here's something you may not know. GoBerkey.com has amazing specials and deals all the time on a wide variety of survival and preparedness products. Most ready to ship same day. Visit the Berkey guy at GoBerkey.com and be sure to click the red Products on Sale Now button. You can always call toll-free 877-886-3653. Again, that's 877-886-3653. GoBerkey.com, home of the Berkey guy. We are America's largest independently owned communications network, GCN. All right, we're back on the bright side, talking about the glomurella, glomurella nephritis. Uh, who we got here? Lori, California. Lori, you there? Yes, I'm here. Okay, so glomurellus, very simple to say, even uh-huh. though it's a tongue twister when you look at it. Actually, <laughs> it, it, means, it means ball of thread. It's a, Latin ter- it's a Latin term for miniature ball of thread, because if you look at the glomerulus, it looks like a ball of thread, except the thread is made up of blood vessels, and the blood vessels act like a spaghetti strainer, or the glomerulus, I should say, the whole, the whole unit acts like a spaghetti strainer, cleaning out the blood. However, when the blood becomes toxic, when the blood accumulates toxicity, when there's stress in the body and hypertension, high blood pressure, when there is uh, blood sugar issues, which can damage the blood vessels, you're going, to run into, uh, you're going to run into pressure problems. You're going to run into filtering problems. The medical model, the lisinopril that you're taking, slows down the pressure or reduces the pressure. That's how it works. It chemically poisons, literally, the cells of the kidney to make less chemicals, so they make less pressure chemicals, less uh, high blood pressure chemicals, something called angiotensin. That's what, how lysinopril works. It's an angio, means blood vessels, angio. Tensin means tension or pressure. It's an angiotensin inhibitor. That's what they call it, angiotensin converting enzyme inhibitor technically. But in any case, they're slowing down the pressure in order to prevent the kidneys from being damaged. What you want to do, Lori, is like I was saying to the last caller, you want to figure out why is your blood toxic, what is, put, is putting the stress in your body, and are you pre-diabetic or diabetic? So there's three strategies for you. Number one, focus on food toxins and food allergies, stuff getting into the blood that shouldn't be there. Move the circulatory system around by getting on a rebound or doing an exercise bike or taking brisk walks. A sedentary lifestyle is a great way to mess up your blood pressure. So move your body around. Number one, focus on digestive system. Number two, move your body around. Number three, take supplements that will help improve blood supply and help improve the, body, uh, the health of the blood. Magnesium, very important. The Biolumin Nightly Essence, very important. Digestive enzymes. These are all the things we just talked about. The B complex, super important for the blood, especially niacin. I'd be on 200 milligrams a day of time to release niacin. Oxygenation is very important, making sure you're using your deep breathing techniques. And last but most certainly not least, please make sure you're controlling your blood sugar by using more protein, not willpower, using more protein throughout the day. As long as you don't have an allergy to whey protein, it's the best. Egg protein is also good. Um, meat is not quite as good because you've got to deal with all the stuff that's in meat. But if you want meat, that's, you know, at least that's a source of protein. The best way to reduce your blood sugar, you guys, and, and by the way, Lori, uh, glomerular nephritis, all kidney diseases are signs of blood sugar problems. The best way to lower your blood sugar, reduce your blood sugar concentration, is to eat more protein. And also drinking water with, uh, drinking a lot of water throughout the day can help. Always making sure you're using your Beyond Tangy Tangerine. You have so many strategies here, Lori. There's no need for prescription drugs. These are all ways that you can uh, get yourself off that ACE inhibitor, that lysinopril, uh, and also help your kidneys, too. Does that, is that is helpful, ma'am? Is it possible to, 
Yeah, I've got a couple other questions. Sure. Is it possible to have high blood sugar without it ever showing up anywhere? Because I don't have that result. Well, you don't know. How do you know? Oh, on your panels and stuff? On your blood tests? Yeah. Yes, and absolutely. I've been doing this since Absolutely. Every six months for okay, Absolutely. Blood high blood pressure yeah. occurs. High blood pressure occurs on a continuum. It's not like a switch. It's not like one. Yeah. W- yeah go ahead. I, I was asking about high blood sugar. I'm sorry. High, that's what I meant to say. High uh, blood sugar occurs on a continuum. It's not like there's one switch and all of a sudden you have high blood sugar. It occurs gradually. The marker.